on uh, nine o'clock the 28th of May. Is it still 21? April. 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 21st. <laughs> 28th. I thought this was May. Are there any changes to the agenda? Okay. Uh, if not, I need approval for the minutes of March 31st. I'll make a motion we approve the minutes. Okay. I can't because I wasn't here. So. Okay. Uh, can I second it or we don't need a... Um, no, they're just a receiving motion. file. So, okay. And they're going to okay. go to the board anyway. So the, mo the minutes are approved. Uh, public comment. Is there anybody out there in the public that wants to make a comment? Uh, Fred, you're sort of public and you're sort of not, but you're welcome to make a comment if there's anything you need to say. Okay, no public comment. Uh, financial state, are you, is that going to? Uh, Start with me? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. We are reporting on the month of March. So if you go to page 17, in your packet, page 17 is the statistical volumes for the month of March. Long term care, every month had average distance of 51.3. The budget was 55.1. And here today, they're at 49.7. The ER had. 437 visits for the month, the budget at 612. Year to date, there are 4,418. In the prior year, they were 5,464. Um, escape to acute care, which had an average daily census, including the swing beds, of 3.6 for the month. Year to date, they were at 6.1. In the prior year, for the same period, they were at 6.7. The outpatients for the month were 1,983. The year to date, total of 12,971. The prior year, the total was 9,899. In those counts are all the COVID uh, testing and shots that we did, so that's bumped up the volume a bit. Visits were 1,441 for the month. The special visits, which are the telehealth visits, were 354. Year to date, they were at 13,576 primary visits, whereas last year they were at, for the same period, 12,879. Uh, the telehealth visits were 2,713 year to date, and the prior year they were 2,577. Uh, mobile van for the month had 1,127 visits. They were still going out and giving shots, so year to date they had 2,735 visits there. Uh, there were no outpatient surgeries during the month. They had, I mean, no inpatient surgeries. They had one outpatient surgery and 41 scopes. Year to date they had one inpatient, 25 outpatient, and 350 scopes. The retail pharmacy held 3,578 scripts per month. That's 142 over the budget. Year to date they were at 29,847, whereas in the prior year for the same period they were 3,881. Um, are there any questions about any of the volumes? It's just difficult because of COVID, no one's going to change the night. So, if there's no question about page 12, which is the revenue and expenses for the month, page 12 on the bottom of the page. Our revenue for the month is 9,150,000. That's 1,236,000 for the lower budget. But it's more than we had in the prior year for the same month, which is about when COVID things started happening. Um, after our projections for revenue, we had 2,736,000. And our expenses were 2,660,000. We even had a surplus of 5,000. And then with our non operating revenues, we ended up with a surplus of 103,961 for the month. In the prior year for the same month, we would have lost 159,000. Um, are there any questions? Oh, there was a, I missed some bond of the page, so the IGT payments on there, and I missed putting on any of the money in early in the month. It was for $1,942,540. So I will make sure that's updated in the date. Barbara? Yes. We also have the, the purchase services, which can come back to the Quest uh, purchase service uh, spread three months, right? Not all three. You have to bring back uh, two of them, I believe. Okay. So this is two months later? Yes. Okay. So the idea of that, we did on the October 1st, we did make money. Not operating, not operating. Which is a good thing. Yeah. How much money? 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 How much the only point that that before we were using was America uh, Bank, uh, the bank credit, whatever you call it. Uh, we're looking at it now. Right now, we're going to down. Uh, just cash again. So, we're going to be able to start to go back to that, right? Right. So, we can get a part of the for something. Okay. Okay. Look, if you deflate a little bit, look at the non-operating portion. Look at the bottom versus other non-operating revenue. See the 350,000 versus the budget of 51 and 952. That's where the items appear from the settlements that we know we're going to get to eat at that time. So, that's why it's going up. So, year to date, our page 13 is year to date. Our last revenue was 340,000. Um, compared to last year, the same period, we were at 52,000 profit. Any questions on your dates? So, the doors are 23. Just our calculation of the accounts receivable days and the APAs. At the end of March, it was 78.4 accounts receivable. We're still working down on a lot of old things. Uh, and the accounts payable, it was 39.8 days. Any questions? Following page 24 is the cash collections for the month. We started with 3,680,000. We collected 2,421,000. This is cash. We got um, our payment uh, 401,000 from uh, for MDPH quality payment. And a couple other tax checks in the month. Uh, we paid out a total of 2,764,000, which um, includes that IGT amount. And we were not operating or reserve counts. We ended with 9,267,000, or we budgeted to get 313,000. Do you questions, Ash? Yeah, that's really good. I guess we're going to go with this chat. Can I just go to page 26? These are the new bond payments. Can you just tell me exactly what I see to the new bond payments? Sure. The guitar IC, I'm not sure what else I have to do. Bond payment ratios, we catch up the ones from the prior bonds, and then we don't have to have some of the ones from there, we have to have new So the first one is the bank available for the debtors. It was on the prior bonds as well. You can see we actually do this on a year-to-date basis. So there we have a the income that was like for the year to date to March, um, the depreciation is uncashed shortly and all the interest. And so our medical bill, all we have the income that we apply to work the interest, all the basic is only 3,500 dollars Uh, obviously, we've got to do better than that's what it is. Actually, we have the interest, uh, we have the income fees, the interest is the interest, obviously, 60,000. That's what we wanted. We have the interest, um, as far as 16,000, uh, then we have to, and then we actually use it. Uh, interest is the interest, 3,500. So, we're trying to get the interest, the interest average ratio, we're supposed to have 1.5. We have to put one sort out there, and we have to be done, and we have to do the sum of this. The 
Sunday show is the greatest of the blues. These are the interesting of Kevin Moon. The Cardinals are 14.3. Star Cardinals actually is 1.75. And Bucky will have 1.4. We'll do that. We have 40% more assets. And the blues. Alex Rams here. Cash on hand is moving. I was trying to form a sheet. So I believe that they have a price. So the cash, cash, cash on hand is 2.5 million. We're going to cash on hand with the blues. All the potential BS. It's only 17 million. So the final million cash available on hand. And it looks like everything. Our reports three months are 7.3. That's what we're going to do. So we actually have 7.3 million point five days in cash. We're going to cash on hand. Okay. So above that. And we actually hope we cover more than the cash on hand. Even without any of the cash. And that's what we're going to do. That's what we're going to do. Yeah, I'm going to 